switch gears back to business where Warren Buffett is a man in a hurry. Today he announced he is buying Lubrizol for $9 billion only weeks after saying that his trigger finger is itchy and that he is on the hunt for acquisition. So he made his first buy. I know, Sheila, you've been following this. We actually, right, Bloomberg guessed this correctly, right, that Lubrizol was one of the candidates. No, that's right. So a couple of weeks ago when uh, Buffett made the announcement that he was getting ready to buy, you know, Bloomberg actually put together a screen based on a lot of typical Buffett measures, so return on assets, growth, net income margins, etc. And Lubrizol actually showed up on the screen. Lo and behold, we are here a few weeks Good later, a $9 billion <laughs> deal. A couple of other stats on the deal here. It's a premium of 24% to Lubrizol stock. You can see where the stock is trading at right now. Also, it's the second largest acquisition by Buffett in the past five years. Of course, the largest one being the Burlington Northern. And it's also a big deal for the chemicals world. In fact, it's the biggest chemical deals we've seen all year. So it's a pretty big deal here. You know, one of the things I wanted to highlight was how nicely Lubrizol fits in terms of what Buffett likes to buy. Yep. It's a very steady eddy company, very stable margins. You know, this is a company that makes additives, lubricants for industrial systems. So if a company has invested a ton of money into their big system, they need lubricants to keep it going. This business isn't going away. It's one of those businesses that's always there producing steady cash flow. And you know, when Buffett bought Burlington last year, he'd mentioned that he really believed in the upturn of the economy and things coming back. Mm -hmm. Well, this also has the same kind of implications for this business. You know, it's highly uh, based on chemicals. So as industrial production starts to turn around, they're going to need a lot more of these. Right. And as you say, it is classic Buffett, right? It's an unglamorous industry or company, but it has good pricing power. So then he buys it. Thank you.